Germany won the last FIVB World Tour event in uh, Otzen in Poland. And uh, if they can find that kind of form, they will be the team to beat. But they've played nothing like the volleyball that they played just a couple of weeks ago. Let's get that first house. Nick Vicenna from the United States were there. Also, Alison and Bruno, the defending gold medalists, were there. It was a stacked tournament. So, Flugen. And Bachermann made it happen with plays just like that. And an opportunity to get the kill. And it just goes into the net. But that is the story right there. Really high and really low. Oh, Ranieri at the net. No way out for Germany. And they hold on to their impressive early Ranieri with service for Italy. Again, the Italians have decided that Bockerman is the man they're going to try and target with their serve, trying to keep Flugen out of the game. And you might wonder why they go. year old from uh, Hamburg, Germany, serving Karambula, who now attacks for Italy. Great play from Karambula. Nice timing on the ball. And Italy are heading into the tech timeout with a real buffer here comfortably ahead 14-8 Italy with service Karambula a very tricky float serve with topspin and Ranieri's there at the net 15-8 almost impossible to stop Italy now Dane this is Alex Ranieri at his best he delays his block goes up and Dane Blanton has put it perfectly just forget about it and start afresh exactly what they do Flugen puts the first point on the board for Germany now can they find their confidence rhythm and groove here 2017 season here's a golden opportunity of course at the world championships to bounce back but um, you're absolutely right they don't have the energy they don't have the charisma that they used to bring to the court and, and I think that's just lack of confidence and disappointment with their tour so far Callum Buhler in the defense perfectly Nice set. Karambula puts it away. Well, they're trading side outs. It is better play from Germany. Nice hit right there. How about that? Rangieri. Look at him. He's feeling good. That was a slam. We've seen a couple of those. His hat comes off. He doesn't care. He's going to strut it out. Right back at you. A little yeah. roll shot. Cross court to the open court. And this is, uh, I think, what has plagued the Italians lately is just out of bounds. starting to find a bit of rhythm now isn't he to get himself back into the match Italy did such a good job of keeping him out of the game in the first set I'm not sure why they might often in that first set it seemed to, to work Bockerman serves Karen Bula Karen Bula has one on to the ball Rangieri's not going to chase that one down and in the, the tech look on their eyes are they're almost playing a little bit angry that like you said, they're not happy with the form, with the way that they have finished right there. Karambula putting the ball down the line, but you saw the interaction there. It's like we've talked this out plenty. It's now about getting on the court and making it happen, happen out they there. Did. As you mentioned, you don't have a coach. You don't have a third set of eyes, so you got to work it out between you and your partner. Well, there's the power play that uh, Karambula was calling for from his partner. Bockerman paid for it. Wow, Flugen delighted to have uh, jousted, out jousted Rangieri. See, it's simultaneous contact, so Flugen can have that open hand, and then the big yell through the net forces Rangieri. Wow, look at that point to the bike step. A little serves Flugen. Karambula's there. Bockerman now for Germany. 
off the fingertips of Ranieri. We're going to a third set. It's a tie-break in the last match. You still need to win by two clear points. Ranieri on the attack for Italy. Good save. Second time. Oh, it takes him three attempts, but Ranieri finally gets the ball down to the sand. Smart play. Way to hang in there. Ranieri not giving up, persisting at the net. He's been dominating the net. Bachermann knows he had an opportunity. Could have given us a little bit more of his power play in that rally there, Dane. Yeah, maybe. I just don't think he was in position to do so. Karamula not happy with one of the digs. But this is kind of a broken rally back and forth. That ball definitely was going to land in bounds. They continue to go to Lars Lugan. Karambula has this one covered. Oh, but this time Bockerman is there at the net, doing the job that he's out there to do. Flugan cross-court to Karambula, over on two for Ranieri. Quick, powerful play from the Italian, and a valuable point on the board. Italy go three clear once again. That was an absolutely beautiful... Bockerman this time serving Ranieri, nice back set from Karambula. Ranieri powers that one down the line. Yeah, a kiss and a little point to the ear. Good serve, deep to Flugan. Karambula gets a hand to it. Ranieri digs deep. Karambula puts that one down. Shot of the match. What athleticism right here. Karambula with a right hand, stabs it up, and then reaches high and tags it deep into the court of the Germans and... The Italians have really turned things on again. It looks like set number one when there was complete domination. This is exactly the potential that we know from this Italian duo. That's a beautiful play from Lars Flugen. Karambula again, he keeps his mission with the sky serve. No. And the ball is out of play. Italy go forward through to the round of 32. We say goodbye to the German...